Hi, this is technically end of week eight, but truthfully, I have not been on diet the last week, not at all. So last Sunday I didn't post because I was still um, involved with the wedding that I was at. And then the Monday after I ended up going out to a dinner party and then I had a date night with friends and then it just like went downhill from there. So I have been off diet for seven days, eight days now. Um, and I can tell, I can tell. I feel run down and I feel... Um, run down, I would say, um, less energy. Um, I feel like my immune system's not up to par. Um, I don't know. So anyway, this week will be different. Uh, I've told everyone involved in my life, like, okay, I'm stepping back up. Like <laughs> I'm going to take charge. I'm going to get back on it this week. So that's my goal for the end of week nine to be able to say that I was back on diet. So that's my goal for this upcoming week. I'd say the hardest part about getting back onto this diet is being prepared. Um, I could have done it throughout the middle of last week and just didn't because I was not prepared. I didn't have food ready. I hadn't gone grocery shopping. I didn't have anything pulled out of the freezer. I didn't have lunches prepared, nothing for breakfast. And my coffees were good. My coffees maintained pretty okay. I've been making my own cold brew, so that's been fairly easy. And I've actually come to terms with the fact that I like it more than going out and getting coffee. The last coffees, that, coffees I've tried to get have been not great. So I've definitely liked my own more. So, I just needed to post something because I didn't last week. And then this week was also a big fail for me. But the good thing about this diet is it is easy to get back onto. I have food pulled out of the freezer for lunches and dinners. Um, I've got sausage made up. My grandma helped me make up some plain sausages for breakfast sausages. And I'll do my eggs. I've got my coffee prepared. Um, and I have no outings planned. So it's easier to move forward with the mindset of... I don't need to go out and I won't be going out. So I don't need to go out. So I'll just keep making my own food. Um, in the last week and a half though, I have spent like it's cheaper obviously to not go out, but the amount of money people spend on food nowadays going out is ridiculous. So that's been not fun to remember, but the wedding was great and the food was actually, the food wasn't that great, <laughs> but I didn't bring my own food. So I ate what was given. Um, and coffees in the last week have not been that great either. They've tasted really sweet and then the coffee tastes really burnt. And it's just like whenever I do go out, it's not as good. Like honestly, the best meals that I've had during my cheat times are homemade meals, like a homemade burger. It's just way better than a, like a outing with a burger and fries because usually the fries are soggy and not as good. And then there's the desserts I've been having just aren't like I don't know, like they used to like fulfill me and be like, oh my gosh, this dessert is so good. But now they're just kind of like, that really kind of filled me up in a not so great way. And now I feel awful. Like it's not rewarding anymore. So anyway, it's late. I just needed to get something out here and let y'all know that I'm back on it. Um, and then I have not been back on it. So I'm excited to start feeling good again. And, um, my clothes definitely started to fit looser. They are getting a little bit back to normal, but still pretty loose. Um, the jeans that I'm actually wearing right now, I can usually, I used to be able to wear them like three or four times without them feeling kind of loose. And now after one wearing, um, they are loose. So I'm still feeling pretty good about the progress that I've made up to this point. Um, I'm going to wait a week before I, weigh myself and do my measurements though to give myself the week to get back on it. Um, so cheers to this upcoming week and good luck to you if you're doing this. Um, and if you've watched all my videos or even just this one, thank you. I appreciate it. Um, I don't know if it's helping anybody, but it's good for me to verbalize it because it keeps me on track, keeps me accountable, accountability, and it's something I can go back and watch if I need to hear myself say what I have to say. <laughs> so Anyway, that's what I got. End of week eight. Week eight. Wow. Wow. Does not feel like two months, but when I think about it, it's like, yeah, it's been eight weeks. Crazy. Anyway.
Goodbye.